Sunny's Garden. I'm just gonna let Sunny introduce herself real hey, uh, quick. Welcome to Sunny's Garden. I have two cats and one dog. I used to be on a praise team and a choir growing up. I had two surgeries, one when I was 18, then another one I had in like 2015. When I get a bigger space, I'm, I'm gonna get a greenhouse or a hoop house or something. Why does she want a greenhouse? So, I have a knife sharpener for little things to help you water your plants when you're not around. And stick that right in your plant. This one will fit. They said a water bottle. Look. Let me see if they got any you know, things to make it make it fit. No. No. Well, being in Philly, she wants to extend her growing season. Sunny's been on YouTube for over a decade, but she took a hiatus. And Sunny is now back and playing in the dirt. And the chainsaw. Sunny has tiptoed over into quail also. Growing in her knowledge and on her property <laughs> and in years, Sunny is taking us along with her. I am on my way to start my birthday celebration. Say her birthday Monday. Make sure y'all give her a shout out. Are you ready to grow too? I didn't think that I was gonna get anything. Check out Sunny's garden. The chicken. What do you do when you have around 40 chickens and a YouTube channel? The chicken is the most foul channel. That's a joke, boy. <laughs> you missed it. Went right past you. You gotta keep, I say you gotta keep on your toes. Put toes, that is. But the fast ones get right by you. I want you to know something. There's nothing in here. That's a sign that a baby chick is dead. Anyways, let's do the rest of the video. Chicken topics abound on this That's channel. That's the point. We're going to be talking about what it's like living with 38 chickens. We would have like 70 something right now if, if none of our chickens died. So yeah, I'm going to really quickly feed them, check on all of them, and I'm going to show you what life is like with them. This is an easy way I get all the chickens out of the poop. I mean, it's like 7.30. I think that's what everybody got. Baby chicky chicks in here. You can see how they're not really babies anymore. If you listen to clucking, hey, no being out. Yeah, we're moving them out to the farm flock any day now. The live chicken cams and the other live streams, they're pretty entertaining, especially the trivia. The chicken sometimes shows general homesteading and farm topic videos, like gardening. Most of them in the second row came up. Actually, I think just about all of them. These were where the peas used to be. And... Literally just about all the other ones in here came up as well. Alright, so if you think the rules that apply to this garden in particular, the garden in our backyard here, doesn't apply to you, well you're wrong. So if you think that you can't grow food or raise chickens in whatever space you're working, the chicken tries to show you how you can adapt your living space to accommodate the lifestyle. Check out the chicken! Don Yarn Doll. If you are into yarn art, especially crocheting, Dawn Yarn Doll is right up your alley. Okay. You're about to kick in in a minute, probably. Oh, very nice. The live streams are where it's at for Dawn. Hello, YouTube friends. Hey, my, well, Lisa, I will wait for you. <laughs> Lisa, you're lucky she's screaming at us. <laughs> I got to drive hours to get to my Kmart. They're quite a lot of fun. Connections, connections, connections. Or if you're a yarn craft person, magic knots, weaver's knots, and invisible knots. <laughs> Every time I turn it on, I fall asleep. The chats get pretty interesting. No, I mean, I did. I said hi. I went to Katrina. I said, yeah. Don Yarn Doll's live streams dispel the myths that yarn crafting is just a hobby for certain demographics. 
So if you're into yarn works or you just want to chat with people who are also awake at ungodly hours, <laughs> you should definitely check out Don Yarndall. The Garden Bee Log in Philly. Chickens, chickens, and more chickens. The Yarn Crafters Support and Hangout. Are these your people?